Juju did a really cool non-traditional sort of high school thing where she just ended up living in France for a year. Right? Mm -hmm. and she also has like the cutest sense of style. Thanks. Um, <laughs> yeah. I'm wearing all black today, so it's not really. Yeah, you can't see today, <laughs> but I promise every other day it's awesome. <laughs> I'm going to show you inside Fells and where I live in the Upquad. <laughs> okay, I live in this apartment kind of space uh, with right now two, but normally you live here with three friends. So I'm going to show you around. So this is our common space. So you can kind of personalize the space how you like it. We've added a mini fridge and a toaster oven, and we have our own table that a friend built us. Um, and this is where we keep our dishes and stuff. This is my room. Kind of feels like being in a tree house, which is nice. Um, I like my bed up very high, and that way I have a nice view of the mountains over there. And this room has really good light. That's probably my favorite part about it. Um, we do a lot of like dancing here. Yeah, I think this yeah. is a space when a lot of people want to get together. This is where people come because it's such a big private space. Sometimes we project movies. We play some games here. Mm -hmm. Sometimes study. Yeah. yeah. Study plays. Totally. Tulsi plays her banjo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is Dudes. It used to be our dining hall. This is also where we have Trivia Thursdays. That's like a big thing on campus. Do that. <laughs> um, this is like a skateboarding situation. Um, and a lot of, I've seen a lot of people make some four square games. That's been really fun. Some roller skating happens in here. I got Marley. Um, because she, her birthday is really early in the year, um, yeah. which is really hard your freshman year if it's in September because you're just starting to meet people. Um, but she had a birthday party outside um, on the Lily Lawn yeah. um, and invited anyone who wanted to come, and I just thought that was really nice. And I remember just thinking she was so open and friendly, and that's where we met. Yeah. At like 11 p.m., on some like inconspicuous night. Very inconvenient. Um, very inconvenient, normal, normal, stressful normal, night. Stressful night. Everyone's in their finals. Room. Everyone's stressing out. Um, there is like the bell rings and you know that it's time to go to midnight breakfast and midnight breakfast is like the sweetest thing ever. It is where our professors and like um, yeah, other faculty and staff kind of hang out and serve us breakfast at midnight. Um, and all the music faculty kind of like make a band and they all perform like classic hits. It's really fun. And we all just like <laughs> dance on tables and like sing along. We went um, to like 2 a.m. this yeah, past year. The we teachers went just kept. Real we, late. We just we kept forced them to keep playing. <laughs> it was so fun. So we're going to take you to Tishman, which is our movie theater. Yeah, um, it's kind of like an auditorium esque space. One of my favorite memories here is there was a really big snowstorm one night um, and Marley and I and a bunch of our, of our other friends screened uh, The Shining here and that was really, really fun just to be cuddled up here. Um, and this space, like most spaces at Bennington are 24 seven. So if you wanna come watch a movie or screen the debate um, or be part of the PowerPoint club, you can come here at any time. I can't take you into the room right now because there's a meeting going on, but um, this space is the editing studio where I spend a lot of time editing my videos. So like I said, a lot of spaces here are 24-7, so since I'm in video classes, I can rent a key whenever I need to, and I go in there to edit videos. Um, a lot of late nights in there, a lot of early mornings, um, but it's really nice the night before videos do for a class. A lot of people are in there working on their own videos, um, and you can kind of be like, hey, check mine out, and check someone else's out. It's just a nice bonding experience. So this is kind of my safe haven. Um, there seems to be class in here, but they're not here right now, so we'll just sneak in. This is D207. It's where most intro theater classes happen, um, directing classes happen in here. My favorite thing, and what really struck me on my tour, is that every, we have like five black box theaters and every theater is up for grabs at any time. Um, so I'm directing a piece kind of on my own away from the faculty right now just for fun. 
and I get to use an actual professional space to be able to do that. Um, we've got a great lighting rig also in here, sound system. Yama's curtain is like all of the props you could ever wish for. Slowly but surely all of our friends became friends and then we were all friends and we hung out a lot over the summer mm -hmm. after our freshman year. Um, and we've been inseparable ever since. <laughs>